Here we are with Mauro. What we will talk about? So we can talk about how our range about the PB installation testers and IV cup tracers. So we have a complete line about the PB stuff because we are the most skilled company in the world that make this kind of uh, testers. So we can start from PB check that is a multifunction installation tester for PV installation and with this instrument you can <clears throat> you can measure uh, in a one test just in one test you can measure VOC ISC insulation up to 1000 volt and RPE so the continuity about the uh, ground conductor okay so we are talking about safety of the PV system Am yeah, right absolutely absolutely okay that's right then what do you have here so we have here even the IV400 that is a uh, IV cup tracer. So you can check the performance and you can do a troubleshooting of your PV installation because uh, you know it, it, it's really common to find some problems about the, 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 the single panel into the strings. Yeah. So with this instrument you can measure the IV cup or your string up to 1000 volt and 10 amps. And, uh, after, if you have a bad car, you can you can cut off your string, and after you can do again the test, and after you can you can check if the car is okay or not okay. And so, how can I put the target data of my panel inside the instrument? Oh, I will do it problem. manually. Yeah, you can do it manually or in or from the software. So, if we are talking about cool tracers, is for maintenance. Am I right? Yeah, yeah, you're right. So, you need IB400 to do a maintenance, to do a troubleshooting in a PV installation. So, the problem, the common problem is that, so you have a single panel into the string that may have a problem. So, with this instrument, you can find the problems because you can trace your IV carb of your string up to 1000 volts and 10 amps. So can I take the environmental parameters inside the instrument that are correlated, of course, or to the electrical test that I'm doing? Yeah, yeah, that's right. So this is the key point of your question. So this is a reference cell that is a standard accessory for about for, for the IV400, and with this that are that has uh, mono and poly inputs. You can measure the uh, sun irradiance and after the instruments with this data can compare your IV car to the manufacturer IV car because okay. into the instruments we have a, a database of the panels and you can choose your panel and after the instrument give you an outcome okay or not okay if your car it's okay or not okay. So I can check which is the panel that is broke. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, you can find the panel into the string. It seems very lightweight. Absolutely. Lightweight. Sorry, let me say, we don't need any laptop. We don't need any, anything. We have the we string have here beach. and we don't need two people. Okay. That's it. And so, always concerning IV tracing, how do you avoid the problem of Wi-Fi connection? That is a problem where you have big distance to go. So, we solved this problem with this one. So this is a solar accessory for solar IV and solar 300 then and this is uh, op optional accessory for IV 400 and it's really really nice because you can connect this with the cable to the solar 02 and after you can connect even the temperature sensor here. So when you turn on this and when you turn on the IB400, you can see that those two instruments uh, will be synchronized. So when those start to synchronize, you can see that the clocks of those two instruments are the same. So when you have the same clock, you have the data because this record the environmental data and this record the power data. So when you come back, and you put this <coughs> near the IV400, you have your environmental data related to power data at the same clock, and no problem. Okay, Mauro, what about the uh, efficiency of the inverter? Could you test it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the HT instruments 
is the only company that gives to the, the people uh, the possibility to measure the inverter efficiency uh, and three single phase and three phase inverter efficiency in a multifunction testers. So the problem is you don't have to buy a continuity tester, insulation tester, uh, inverter efficiency tester. No, we have a multifunction tester like this. So this is a power quality analyzer. It's a full power quality analyzer that compliance to uh, to the standard, to the guideline EN 5160. After, okay. right. Thank you, Thank you. you can see uh, your inverter performance with really easy, easy to understand interface. So let me let me explain to you. So now we are in a, a power quality configuration, okay? So we wanna make a PV3 phase settings, okay? Save data. It's a completely touch screen instrument. And after here, as you can see, you have all data that you need to understand the problems of losing energy. So at the, the left side here, you have the DC power, DC voltage, and DC current. And the right side, you have the power of the AC side, power factor, and all that you need to understand the three-phase AC side. So, when you do the measure, and at the end of the measure, the instrument give you an outcome. Not just numbers, give you an outcome, okay or not okay. Because so you know if you are losing power. Absolutely, absolutely. Okay or not okay. This is the key of the point. You don't have to understand anything. The instrument give you an outcome okay or not okay. Clever. Yeah. So you tell that is a full power quality analyzer three phase. What do you mean? Oh, it's really complete power quality analyzer. As you can see, as you can see here. So, full wire plus neutral plus ground. Yeah, no problem. We can save the data here and I want to show you how many parameters that you record at the same time. So here you can find uh, all of the parameters that you can measure. So general parameters are frequency, voltages, currents, power, cos phi, power factor, harmonics, up to 49th for voltage and current. After you can see the voltage anomalies with your personal, your own trigger, you can decide with your trigger the numbers. So the, vol the nominal voltage and the nominal trigger. So that's really easy. In rush current, in, in rush current, Flicker, unbalance, and fast transient with a five microsecond resolution. Very good. Yeah, yeah. So, and as you can see, that's really, really light product and really, really high quality product. Where are they made? So, we manufacture all of our instruments in Italy. Nice place. So, as you can see here, all is made in Italy.